but I think it is time to see if we can fix the hole in between my legs. It's time to see if we can get rid of the mangina. How do they, how do they know each stone fit in? I mean, do you think we're going to come up with that? I, I, I probably will. It's in the Charlie book of everything. If you're ever approached by an elephant, if it starts coming at you like that, it's what they call a false charge, hopefully. And what you've got to do is stand your ground and make yourself very big and shout and make yourself big and noisy, but don't move. And then he'll stop and he'll think, well, I don't know why that thing's not moving. And, and then he'll go away. Unless it's a real charge, in which case you'll be dead. I got a box of sweets. <laughs> you wouldn't got a swipe. You got a box of candy. Yeah, 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 whatever. Yeah, you know. That's why. <laughs> Maybe I'll go and stick my camera on that. That was the dark not me. Colour coding confuses your enemy. This <laughs> makes for a Go to my shoes and everything. I'm not clashing with my shoes. I don't think I'd want to cuddle a gorilla. I think, you know, imagine I'll see a All right, Charlie. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> well, what can I say about Botswana? Open up your mind and see like me Open up your plans and damn your free Look into your heart I'm available for parties Yeah, but I miss this Be mindful of your thoughts, they betray you <laughs> People come up and go, look at the size of your exhaust pipe I mean, people come up and say that to me anyway but... <laughs> I always like to throw up when I get out of the plane. <laughs> well, we'll be surviving, generally surviving around. Shadowing over here, hawking over there. I think you're under the call. <laughs> and Ebs, mum and dad are going to be joining us in Namibia, and then her brother in Botswana. The Ewan McGregor family tour. We'll be back tonight, okay? You're nothing without my navigational skills. You're useless without me. I'm going to sew the back and the top together. No, no, <laughs> I'll put them on and my balls will go up behind my ears. <laughs> They say that's me sorry, isn't it? There's a Welshman named Paul, and a hammer, and a sheep. This is Barbara. <laughs> <laughs> One guy recognised me, this kid out here in the yellow t-shirt recognised me, he went, you make movies? And I went, yeah. He said, why did you not arrive in a big car? I said, well, because I'm doing a trip on a motorbike, blah, blah, blah. He said, you have a bodyguard? And I said, I have ten of them. They're all right, to be very careful. Just like Ferris Canyon back home. It was just great to be back with Charlie. What do you want? What do you want? What do you want? Yeah. <laughs> You're a good looking man, you see? Look, we can go even closer. Oh, yes. Strong. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Charlie's got malaria, he's feeling a little tired, and he's got malaria. It's not the case that we've just been on the road for 12 weeks and relentlessly chewing through hundreds of miles every day. No, malaria. Cool. Join us after the break to find out if Charlie really does have malaria. Because you're supposed yeah. to sort of go, oh my god, does Charlie have malaria? <laughs> All right, hang on, let's see again. Hang on, hang on, hang on. <laughs> okay. Let's see again. F. I think Charlie might have malaria. Is perfect, that perfect. Is that there? <laughs> I see this for 10 minutes. Okay. Dave? Yeah, it's you and uh, look, I think Charlie's got malaria. Could be the end of the trip. Don't be taking me seriously. <laughs> Die. Do you and yeah, let's, what are the symptoms for malaria? I think Charlie's got malaria. Could be the end of the trip. <laughs> Negative C. C. Yeah, no malaria. Faint line across there. I could see you were really, really worried. I was really worried. I tell you what the next worry is. Yeah. What do you have? Oh yeah, what do you what have? What is it? I have 
road fatigue. Yeah, you're just tired. <laughs> you're fucking knackered is what it is. And really, I just wanted to use this as well. <laughs> right on the sand, not having a fall. I think I'm going to get Jim Foster to ride my bike to Cape Town and I'll just smuggle myself in the back of the car. <laughs> iPod on, snacks, no numb arts. I'll be able to feel my hands, I'll be able to feel my feet. Be fantastic. Uh, Let him worry about falling off the fucking thing. <laughs> Three o'clock. <laughs> and it's all horrible off road, so. <laughs> How are you, old man? I want to burn down to Cape Town and try and avoid meeting anyone or seeing anything on the way. And then we get to Cape Town with a huge party and everyone thinks we're great. We said all that, we should get on though. <laughs> and the perfect way to end an argument over there. Look, so you're going to be discussions here, board meetings, and then if you all fall out, there's some spears over there to just kill each other with. Stand out a shot here, right? Ready? <laughs> all of these Roman ruins are 2,000 years old. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> all the way down, you're the bag of bitches and moans all the way to Cape Town. Now listen here, you children. I want you all to go away. Eh? and come back with some roasted goat. I want a big leg of goat for me. One trolley of big goats. We have a fire. We have a bloody good time. Now hurry up. Be back before sunset. Welcome to Ewan's Wildlife, here in Africa. Oh, it's not David Attenborough, I know that, but it's, it's the best I can do. There's a couple of birds, there's a, another bird, it's a duck. I was sort of implying that we're not hardcore because we never really leave before nine o'clock, so we also, right, we'll leave at seven, right? It's seven o'clock, everyone is up, apart from our Dr. Di Jones. Ah, come on, come on, come on! What time do you call this, Jones? Do you want to come? We're just going to go to Cape Town. Will you stop it in? Um, Cape Town's good, we'll be doing that. This is um, Obi-Wan Kenobi doing a moo noise. Moo! Moo! You know I've always got your heart, Jimmy. <laughs> if I die, it's been a blast. Long way down. Long, Long way down. down. Trip for me. How about? I'm going to have the first donkey and car in North London. I'm going to go totally green. Never mind your Toyota Prius, I'm going donkey power. I just deeted my tent. <laughs> You're amazing. <laughs> the way you, you say that with conviction, please? You're amazing. No, no, really. Oh, okay, right. Okay. <laughs> Hang on, no, no, no. You're amazing. <laughs> you here to see the lines? No, I'm here to see that famous Charlie Borman gladiator. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. He's not always cracked up. Isn't he? Sherry for the missus. Sherry, please. That'll be a 15 Roman shekels. shekels. There you go, mate. Cheers. I'm just trying to explain why it looks like a follow-up. <laughs> because I do, that's why. If you want to come up and tell me in a restaurant that I follow up a lot, don't think twice about it. Because I might just tell you, fuck off if you do. Okay? They have very good hearing, obviously. Because they've got such big ears. And also very good smell. Sense of smell. You can tell because they've got very big noises. I don't think I'm going to let you win out with the My child's my love too much. Your love lies in your love. What was I doing? Hiding behind a tree from an elephant. It was terrifying. It could easily have turned into something a bit nasty and that would really only have myself to blame. We're proud to accept the award for the first tumble of the difficult road to Namibia. Hey, walnut brain. Okay, I'm not kidding. No offense. You're so brave with this fence here. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Cheers. What's the square root of 23? <laughs> Wheels are going round, it's a long way 
Dad.